I told our guys yesterday, you know, you win a Yates Cup, and who has the most Yates Cup uh, in the history of the trophy? The Western Mustangs, and we, and we beat them. Um, so to play in a Vanier Cup against the team that has the most Vanier Cups is, is very fitting and special, and we wouldn't want it any other way. So we respect that team greatly. I have a lot of admiration and respect for Coach Constantine, and we know we're going to get a quality football team. Uh, but our guys are confident. Our guys are loose. Our guys have played 11 uh, football games this year and have done quite well in all of them so that's our game plan is to go one and oh this week do everything so that we have a great body of work a good process and the old cliches you can't turn the ball over you got to execute at a high level and our guys are poised to do that every single monday we've kind of told our guys there's 16 teams in the country practicing then it was eight teams in the uh, country practicing. Last week, there were four teams in the country. And, and this week, it truly is the last week of football here in Canada. The Grey Cup was played this past weekend. The only game left is the Vanier Cup, and our Wilfrid Laurier Golden Hawks are in it. So our guys feel super excited. Our coaches are excited. Uh, but we don't just, you know, we're not just excited by the opportunity. We want to take advantage of the opportunity. So we're focused in to uh, play a good football game. Our guys are just wired that they know they have to work hard, and there's no secret secret to success. The secret is knowing that there is no secret. So hard work does pay off and our players every single year I've been here have practiced up until the Vanier Cup. And uh, you know oftentimes I would tell them how dark it is outside, notice the temperature uh, and notice that only a couple teams are practicing and now that we're truly practicing uh, with a game ahead of us it's special and all those past alumni uh, we're thinking of them this week because they kind of paved the way for this group. Ah!